In this video, we'll figure out the number of atoms for Fe2CO3-3. This is iron 3 carbonate. So when we look at the symbols here, the element symbols, we can see we have Fe, let's just write them out, Fe, C, and O. So for the iron, we have this subscript of two. So there's two iron atoms in Fe2CO3-3. For the carbon, it's not written, but we assume there's a subscript of one here. So we have one carbon in this parentheses here times the three. So this three applies to everything in the parentheses. So one times three, that means we have three carbon atoms. And then oxygen, we have the three here times this three outside the parentheses again. So we have nine oxygen atoms. If we add this all up, we have nine plus three, that's 12 plus two. We have a total of 14 atoms in Fe2CO3, three, iron three carbonate. Sometimes you'll be asked to find the number of atoms in one mole of Fe2CO3-3. In that case, you take the number of each element. For instance, we have two iron atoms, and we're going to multiply that by Avogadro's number. So we multiply 2 times Avogadro's number, and we'll get 12.04 times 10 to the 23rd atoms of iron, Fe, in one mole of iron 3 carbonate. Likewise, if we had 3, we could multiply the 3 by Avogadro's number, and so on. Every once in a while, you'll be asked to figure out how many carbonate ions there are. So this is the carbonate ion. It's one you should recognize. And it's CO3 with a 2 minus ionic charge. Because of this, we have three carbonate ions here in the iron 3 carbonate. This is Dr. B with the number of atoms in Fe2CO3-3. Thanks for watching.